hello. Since I seem to have enjoyed the Wednesday model, maybe I'll do it again. We're going to start with a daily challenge. And dot MN. Oh, this is, I've been here before. I've been in this exact uh, spot in uh, Mongolia. I, I, I feel like I forget which one I did. That was like right in here. Uh, will I actually get the specific location? Eh, I don't know. But this this is Mongolia, and that is the Fine Arts Zanzibar Museum, which we can see from the corner. Can is is <clears throat> no, it is on the street. Um, Max Tower. We're like here then. Mm, no, that's on the side of a road. All right, let's, let's, <clears throat> excuse me, my, my throat is. Fine Arts Zanzibar Museum. Fine Arts Zanzibar Museum. It's facing that way, so we're like right there actually. Let's hit, let's hit home and get this specificity. We're in front of a building right across the street. Dorgio Club. Eh, this is, um, where's that road? Is there a, is that technically, a, I think that's, no, that's a parking lot. That's not a road. Well, maybe, maybe it is. No, I, I, I think this is like, maybe like right there. I don't think I'm going to waste any more time because that's a 5,000er. Well, that guy seems to have beaten us to it. We were 10 yards away. This one, I, I'm not going to be as, uh, <clears throat> as precise and immediately knowing of where we are. Well, this is SA Regional Roads Routine Maintenance. It's a South African National Roads Agency Limited. Is that what this says? Is we going to blur the site out too? No. However, I'm not going to know where this is. Uh, looking at the vegetation, it doesn't help me either. Maybe we're up here because I see like, what was it? A little bit of hill. <clears throat> I'm into my throat. A little bit of hills and mountains. That's kind of like around here where Eswatini and Lesotho. So maybe we're on, maybe we're on that. I don't know. Uh, this is a long stretch of kind of like nothingness here. We were heading in this direction. Let's see if this actually bears any fruit. Probably not. Uh, come on. As we fly down this road, how are we doing? The end of the week is here. You've made it. Congratulations. Who knew such a thing was possible? Not too long from now. Well, N10. We're on the N10. This helps a little bit. Kinda. Um, maybe not. Is, is Priska and Britstown gonna show up anywhere here? There's Britstown. So this is the... Britstown is that way. Where is Priska? Priska's that way, so... Priska, this direction, Britstown, this direction. We are, uh, maybe that intersection. Uh, let's see what this sign says. Is there a sign here? Redlands. Uh, I, I, may, I'm not seeing Sodium Road. What does this say? That probably just says Redlands. Yeah. Sodium Road. This really isn't a road that we're that we've come across here. And I'm not seeing water anywhere here. It doesn't say the distance for either one. Could it technically be this? So maybe we're like right there, but again I didn't see any water. This is probably the safest bet. 
we're going to see if I'm right in one second. No, we were farther down. Not a bad score, though. I will take that. Moving on. Uh, I don't know if I should take that as a sign as um, doing a daily challenge. I, mean, like, I know exactly where this is because I feel like I've actually started on this one. I mean, I think I made mention of this again on uh, Wednesday's one of just being like, I've done a lot of these. <laughs> I mean, the, the the more I do of these, the more um, the more of a chance of me actually getting like a repeat. It's possible. Like I almost feel like this again is one I've gotten before. Is it like a child bike training? Huh. I never had that. I just had my bike and my training wheels. And I was too short for my bike, so I had to use a plastic stool on the side of my porch to actually get on my bike. And I used training wheels until one specific kid on the bus saw me with them on, and, and it just immediately started picking on me. So the first thing I did when I got home was took those training wheels off. I fell a lot <laughs> after it was, after, uh, what is this dude doing, flagging me down? We're in the borough of Douglas. Well, this is... That, that's like Irish wording. Well, font, I should say. Am I going to find a Douglas anywhere here? Uh, I don't know. I've seen a dingle. Maybe we're outside Dublin. Let's see if, uh, well, we got Ballycompog Ghoulish. I don't know. Those are all words I can't understand. This will help me, though. A1. <clears throat> Excuse me. Ramsey, Laxey, are any of those gonna show up here? I know I'm on a I'm on a I'm on a timer here. Uh look for the A1. I'm not seeing A1, which has me oh there's the A's. So we're like maybe up here then. Outside Belfast. Where's Peel? Am I in the right? I don't think this is Scotland. Unless it is. I mean, I am... I am all sorts of confused here. Like, there's the A1. I'm not seeing an A2. It's got to be. It has to be here. Like, why wouldn't, why wouldn't it be? Laxey, Onchan, Onchan, or whatever. Fucking Isla, man. Ah, okay. That threw me for a loop. I did not, did not even think of the man island. It went and did that trick on me using Irish font <clears throat> on the Isle of Man. This is probably the center of um check. However, the flags are very much not blowing, which has me thinking this could technically be Man, why unfurl, damn it. Whoa. Um, it's an interesting thing to have in front of your palace. You got one dude about to get clubbed in the back of the head, another dude about to get stabbed in the back. It's like, here's our country. We club people, pin to the ground, and stab them in the back. It's like, eh, eh, eh. you could maybe do a little better. You're like, yeah, we're, we're sneaky. It's it's Che. It says Czech. All right, this is Prague. Like, this is a cool little lantern thing. So I just have to actually find the center of Pregu. That's a church. This is not a church. This is um. Like, I, I don't know what, like, center 
prog called. So I mean, I'm I've, I've got the 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 capital right. It's just I'm ne I'm not gonna find this uh, this square, whatever you want to call it, unless I happen to see something. Nope. What this restaurant? You're called La Booty. Can I find ooh ooh La Booty? Probably not. We'll find out. Ooh, Labuti. Ooh, Oduku. A lot of U's. Uh oh. Oh, excuse me. That that yawn snuck up on me. I'm 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 sorry. I know how yawns can be. Um. Contagious. I was about to say infectious. That's kind of not the right word, but it kind of is too. I mean, I don't even know if Ulubuti exists anymore as a uh, restaurant now when this was taken, but I don't have anything else to go on other than this is Prague. And that's it. I'm going to guess we were on the, the, the other side. In the Vistapuni Branasi Susosui Susubuj Titanu, of course. Solo Cantu, is this Brazil, is this Mexico? That is a lot of um, billboards. Puente Pet Petino? I think this is Mexico. Immediate credit. He went from a woman in a bikini, now you got an old dude with a ukulele. This is like a... Oh, wait, now we have... Interstate E40, that is an interesting uh, color. OS, that, that's, that's West, I think, right? E, West E40? Famous rapper. E40 has his own interstate. So, E40, I'm assuming that this is the uh the highway i'm just i'm just going to click there i mean e40 kind of goes goes places we're heading west on it 60 kilometers 60 kilometers uh to what i mm, couldn't tell you but does e40 kind of like end i don't see 40 flying around anywhere else here, so maybe maybe it does kind of end here. Anyway, let's maybe go a little farther and it'll it'll uh it'll tell me a bit more like this sign right here. The Oh no, this is Colombia. These are Colombian Colombian flag colors, E40. Let's go down to Is there a 40? Oh boy. Um I'm worried now that I'm not going to find this in time. Oh, we're down here, E40. Gotcha. Let's, uh, Villing, Ecuador, yeah, Villingota. I don't know, it, it seemed weird. E40 is a bit of a long one. We're on the arid side, so maybe we're, like, here. Uh, we're near water, so maybe we're, like, here? I'm not seeing a Villingota anywhere here. Oh, we were farther down. Villingota, is that, is that pop? It is not popping up anywhere. But hey, this one was kind of easy, I think. I mean, there was a lot of very useful clues for the Thursday daily challenge, even though I'm putting this up on a Friday. That's this down. We're going to come back real quick with a 
another uh, little map after this one. I mean, you don't have to go to where. I just have to edit some stuff, and it'd be like nothing actually happened if I actually had to do any of the editing. All right. I just thought of a word, put it in the search thing, and came up with this map. It's going to be hard. I put in the word odd, and this is called odd location. And I'm going into this is probably doing the polar opposite as far as getting a score. But this is beautiful. This is probably like Andorra or uh, Andorra Aura. <laughs> yeah, this this is probably not Andorra. This is, uh, what's the other one? I can't think of the word. Lichtenstein or something. I'm going to go with Andorra, though. But it's like here in Canelo. Very pretty. Let's get down the down the road here. Look at this. Pretty little place. <clears throat> Excuse me. I don't know if I'm going to get to anything in time. I wonder how expensive these places are. They, they they can't be. They can't be cheap. This is probably like Switzerland or something. But I'm just clicking Andor because it's odd. And most people are like, ah, I never even knew this was a country. That, that's my logic for clicking it, and I was right. Look at that. I'm not so much playing the uh, map as I am the person doing it. This is probably a lot of flags here. We're tilted a bit. It's just like Ivory Coast. This guy seems to be drunk as he's walking. I think this is Ivory Coast. Cote d'Ivoire. And what is the capital of Cote d'Ivoire? I Abidjan. It's probably Abidjan. I don't think I've actually had an Ivory Coast guess. Um, <clears throat> so let's let's come back. I want to see this billboard. What are we? Oh, we're we're listing on top of Camp Tree Gripper. Kind of moved around a bit. You kind of dinged up your roof a bit. Let's get, oh, I ran out of time. Well, it was Abidjan. Cool, lucky me, I'm, I'm smart. Granted, they had flags everywhere. This one's probably a tropical island somewhere I'm never gonna guess. No, this, this I feel like I've, I've seen this truck before. This is probably Australia. If it's not Australia, it's gonna be uh, Tasmania, and I'm lost in suburbia. Get me out of here. Uh, we're going to head this way, because maybe this tree with the palm trees in front is going to tell me something, and it doesn't. Trash can. Uh, city council. Thanks. I'm just going to say this is probably Australia, and since it's odd, I'm going to say it's the West Coast, and we're on, like, Perth. I'll just say Perth. Let's see if I'm right. Nope. <laughs> We're in Darwin. So I got the continent right, but Jesus Christ, it's a big continent to get incorrect. Okay. More signage. What do we got? Honorary Fifi Fiavi Ketu South. Is this South Sudan? Could this be something else? I see that flag. I don't remember what that flag's for. And I'm a bit annoyed that I can't. This is Senegal. I mean, we in Dakar? I, mm, this is probably like Sierra Leone or Guinea. Oh, man. But what do we got? No. Nope. Uh, no, I thought I would like show a little star somewhere. Let me know where we are. I'm not seeing French, though, so maybe it's not Senegal. What we got? Oh, I ran out of time. Togo. No, nope, this is actually technically Ghana. It was Ghana. Right on the border with Aflac. You got me on that one. And you're going to continue to get me on this one because... I got no clue. 
I'm coming back here because these look like flags, although the resolution is pretty bad. They just turned out to be houses. God damn it. This is a bit tropical. This one dude seems to be stalking us as we walk along this road because he keeps standing in front of every shot. We get it, dude. You're on Google Maps. It's taking me so long just to get to whatever this is that it's probably not even going to be worth it. Oh, I'm finally in a car. How about that? Ricardo Perez, Panama. Well, looks like you've got yourself a uh, free advertisement here in Panama City. We're probably like on that thing. Or if not, maybe we're down here. I, I, I don't know. Hey, it was. Cool. That's a cool little map. I like that. Quick and brief one again for today. Thank you, all, ugh. Thank you all for watching. If you do have any comments, questions, concerns, complaints, tips, hints, suggestions for anything having to do with this map or anything in general that you may want to see me do, go ahead, put them in the comments below. Or we, <clears throat> I will read them and get back to you. Go enjoy your weekend. I'm going to try to do the same. That's hopefully the feeling I'll have when this weekend's over. Nice relaxation. We'll see, though. I'll talk to you later. Goodbye.